Disconnect the power adapter. Press the power button. Tap the F1 key repeatedly to enter the setup menu. Select the config menu. Select the power menu option. Select the disable built-in battery menu option. Select yes in the confirmation box. The system will shut down and the battery is disabled. Insert a paper clip into the hole on the SIM card tray. Remove the tray from the slot. Loosen the five captured screws. Pry up the edge of the cover near the hinges to release the clips. Lift the cover from the system. Remove six screws from the built-in battery. Lift the battery from the system. Disconnect the fan cable from the system board. Loosen the four heatsink screws in numerical order. Carefully lift the thermal fan assembly from the system. Disconnect the camera cable from the system board. Disconnect both wireless LAN antennas. Remove the black antenna cable from the guides. Disconnect the LCD cable from the system board. Remove the LCD cable and black antenna cable from the guides. Remove four screws from each hinge. Pivot the hinges open about 270 degrees and lift the LCD unit from the base of the system. Insert the hinges on the LCD unit into the base of the system. Pivot the hinges about 270 degrees until completely closed. Install four screws into each hinge. Insert the black antenna and LCD cable into the guides. Connect the LCD cable to the system board. Insert the black antenna cable into the guides on the edge of the system. Connect the black antenna cable to the auxiliary LAN terminal. Connect the gray antenna cable to the main LAN terminal. Connect the camera cable to the system board and insert the cable into the guide. Don't forget to clean the old thermal paste with isopropyl alcohol. And to add new thermal paste before reinstalling the fan. Place the thermal fan assembly into position using the screw holes for alignment. Tighten the four heatsink screws in numerical order. Connect the fan cable to the system board. Place the built-in battery into position using the screw holes for alignment. Press down where the battery connects to the system board. Install six screws.
Place the cover onto the chassis, inserting the edge opposite the hinges first. Press down around the edges of the cover to lock the clips. Tighten the five captured screws to secure the cover in place. Insert the SIM card tray into its slot on the side of the system.